Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Do you like to build some castle or city? That's great because uh, this time we will take a look at the best solitaire strategy board games that involve city building. Hadrian's Wall. In the game you take on the role of Roman general placed in charge of constructing of the legendary wall that must be finished in six rounds you start each round with worker and resource cards and aim to efficiently manage resources to win in this game you must meet specific requirements and accumulate the most piety valor and discipline it is a quite complex flip and ride game with numerous strategies and combos to try out architects of west kingdom in the game you take on the role of a medieval royal architect and construct various landmarks. You must collect raw materials, hire apprentices and keep a track on the workforce. To win in the game you must collect the most victory points that are gained by constructing various buildings and advancing work on the Archbishop's Cathedral. Overall, it is an excellent game that strikes a balance between accessibility and subtle complexities, making it suitable for both new and experienced players who like city building games. Teotihuacan City of Gods It's a complex board game involving city construction, resource gathering, technology unlocking, temple worship, and house construction of a three rounds you are gonna to use dice for actions resources like wood stone gold and cocoa will be crucial for pyramid building and step decoration and the game's strategic depth and replayability make it a popular choice for board game enthusiasts game offers a well-balanced mix of strategy and interaction compared favorably to zolkin with fewer timing issues and more player engagement everdell it is a superb tabletop game that immerses player in a captivating world and offers a highly rewarding gaming experience you must construct your city with uh, critters and uh, structures across the seasons uh, that uh, proves to be both engaging and rewarding. It's an ideal choice for players uh, seeking a medium weight board game that combines challenges and enjoyment. Notably, Everdale stands out with its uh, stunning visual design, making it a delightful addition to your tabletop. Furthermore, its high replay value ensures that you will eagerly return to play this game again and again. Underwater Cities It's a captivating blend of my favorite genus. Uh, offering a worker placement style game with resource management, city construction and solo gameplay. Yeah. The game thematic depth shines through its mechanics, while card and action slot alignment mimic the idea of assigning tasks to experts. Gameplay has different aspects and features with choices to make, and player interaction is minimal, making it suitable for solo play and double-sided boards and variety of cards adds enormous replayability. Really wonderful game. On Mars, If you like complex games, then this is the one. It offers a deep and interconnected resource management experience as you will strive to colonize and sustain Mars. Yeah, the whole planet. The game combines worker placement and tile placement mechanics with a unique shuttle system for strategic movement. Although it is a remarkable game, its steep learning curve and cost may not appeal to everyone. However, for dedicated gamers seeking a challenging and thematic terraforming experience, On Mars is a top choice. 
So what do you think? Let me know in the comments which one of these games is your favorite. Feel free to suggest any other games that apply to this category. If you found this video useful, give it a like, subscribe to the channel and hit notification bell to be always informed about new episodes. And that's it guys for today. Thank you for watching, have fun playing these wonderful games and stay tuned for the next episode.